We're here at the Kid Robot event in San Francisco for the release of the new Street Fighter 2 packs. Okay. So I'm here with Valerie and she works here at Kid Robot. So if you can, just tell us what is this event all about? Uh, so we released the Street Fighter 2 pack today at the keychain. So we put a 2 box set. So what kind of stuff do you guys do here? What is it? What can we expect from Kiro in the future? Do you have any other events coming up soon? Oh yeah, we'll actually be having an event with Frank Kovic next month. Uh, we have a release of a standing lab it. Uh, check our Facebook or our Twitter if you want some more information. Just Kiro about San Francisco. Alright, thank you. Hey Nick, what's up? So I've been hearing around you were looking for some guy. I was, I was. Yeah, a player once a guy with a blue punch, right? That's right. And uh, you just so happen to pull a blind box, the two pack. What figure did you get in the random stuff? Uh, I got the random I got, actually. Wow. That's there you go. Awesome. That's, that's yeah. serendipity right there. That's amazing. Yeah. So, uh, what else did you pick up today? I noticed that your girlfriend has a bunch of blind boxes in there. Actually, she's my fiance. Wow. Yeah, yeah, Thank you. Uh, so, what did you guys end up picking up today? Here, I know. Uh, we also got a fry. More than just Futurama, we got everything here. Futurama. Yeah. Uh, Trade in for a can, I think. Oh, that's cool. See, this is a trade event, so you trade it up. What, what did you trade to get that can? Trade it to get one of the most great characters in Street Fighter. There, there you go. <laughs> just one of the worst characters. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was fun. I played Slash Lane, I love the store. It's cool. Alright, thanks. Alright, I'm here with Jason, and right now he's showing off his collection of the Kid Robot uh, Street Fighter series. So I noticed that there's some characters in here that I don't see on the back of this uh, catalog. So uh, what's up with those? Uh, those are all the custom figures that I collected or made myself. Um, pretty much over the past year since I started collecting. I didn't, uh, I didn't jump on it when it first came out, but uh, once I saw one in person, I just I just had to do it. And then once I completed the, the 20, um, I needed to fill this up with something else, so I was like, okay, I'll do custom. Hey, that's what's up. Yeah. So, like, which ones did you make yourself out of this set? The ones that I made, the first one, was the Mecha Mech Zangi. Um, and then the second one I made was the uh, Shinokuma. And at the same time, I actually forgot, um, I made the uh, Angry what is, Ken. What is his name? Angry Ken? Oh, I don't know. Uh, Violent Ken, Violent Ken, there you go. And then the last one I made from this series was uh, Dan. Uh, and then when I got married last year, a couple weeks before, thank you, thank you, um, I made myself and my, my bride. <laughs> hey, that's what's up. So how long does it take you to make a custom figure? Um, if I had to do it again, I'd probably do it a little bit faster, but my first time, I would say at least four to eight hours each one. Oh, wow. Uh, like Dan, he, he maybe took me even more, maybe like 10, 10, 12 hours. So, so what kind of material you used to, to uh, paint? What kind of paint are you using to custom uh, Spray paint and acrylic uh, pencils. That's it. And, uh, so you just rattle can? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, uh, first you, you got to primer everything. If you're doing a full body, like like I colored like uh, his his whole body is all primer. After the spray paint, uh, then you just uh, paint by hand the rest of it. Hey, that's what's up. So what about the figures that you didn't make? Where did you get those from? Uh, this guy, I got him on eBay from some dude that, I think he was on the forums too. He had that made for him. And then this guy, Akuma, and Chrono from Chrono Trigger, uh, I had him made by Ian the Gamer from the Kid Robot forums. 
Yeah, yeah, he's uh, he's definitely the one that inspired me to do it. He helped me kind of give me tips on how to uh, make my own customs, and uh, it worked out pretty well. Well, you got a nice collection. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, so we just bought a Bison 2 pack, and it comes with uh, this is in the one window, player two Bison, player two colors, and a random. But Kira was also nice enough to pick it up with a free uh, blind keychain. So we'll open that in a second. But let's open up the let's open up the blind box first. So now that we already know what's in there, Bison, let's uh, pop this open real quick. Not even gonna feel it. Just look. And it's a geef, player two. It's not like I already don't have a million of those. <laughs> and uh, these are blind also, I was told, so uh, let's pop one of these open. Thank you, Kidrobot, for hooking it up with one of these. Hey, that's pretty sick. Comes with a card, shows who's on it, keychain. We used to got it's pretty good. Alright, thanks to everyone. Listen, don't nudge yourself. QIM again, and I will shoot you with my gun. I'll shoot your head off too.